In this video, we'll be looking at the application of the concept of parallel connection of resistors in physics to solve problems. Now, the question here says 10 resistors each with a resistance of 1000 ohms are connected in parallel. What is the total resistance? Okay, so how do you solve this question here? First things first, let's write out the solution. Solution. So solution to this question. Now looking at this, we can see that it said um, 10 resistors, each with a resistance of 1000 ohms. Okay, and they are connected in parallel. Now let's recall for parallel connection, right? For parallel, for parallel connection, Recall that if I have some resistance, let's say if I have two resistance connected in parallel, then the equivalent or total resistance is given by taking the inverse of each of them and summing them up. So in mathematical form, I will have one all over the total resistance, thus R total is equal to, if we have two resistance values, it becomes one all over R1 plus one all over R2 where R1 and R2 are the resistors or resistance values. If we have three, it becomes one all over R3. So we'll have this, all right? Now, in this question here, they said 10 resistors, right? Each with a resistance of this. So what happens if we have, let's say, three resistors of the same resistance values, okay? Let's take a resistor, let's say R, and let this be equal to, let's say, 5 ohms, all right? If I'm to get the equivalent, I will have 1 all over R total or R equivalent, okay? That will be equal to 1 all over R1 plus 1 all over R2 plus 1 all over R3. would have this. Now, solving this, I will have uh, this as being equal to, this will be equal to, one all over now we said three resistors of about five ohm so r1 is five plus one all over r2 is five plus one all over r3 is five if i solve this this is equal to of course for this my lcm here i'm having five and five and five so the lcm is five so i have five here you have five divided by five that gives you one times one here and that gives you one Right, so for the first one, I have one plus, so I have plus, I'll still have one here and also one here. So I'll just write them there. So one plus one plus one, and this is equal to one plus one plus one gives you three all over five. All right, so you have one all over R total, one all over R total, it's equal to three over five ohms. We'd have this. Now, here's the catch. Did you know that if I take this, all right, if I take this, for me to do this, the shortcut would be me simply taking 1 all over R total would be equal to 1 all over, or better still, you say the number of resistors times 1 all over the resistance value. This would give you the answer faster. Now, this is equal to, looking at the question there, or looking at this concept here, we said, number of resistors here we said three resistors of five ohms so the number of resistors is three times one all over the resistance value is five and this would simply give us what there three over five ohms the same answer as we had here so instead of going through this long process we could just use this shortcut all right so n times one over r when it comes to parallel connection all right so here's your formula now with this concept in the question that is said uh, let's see this again. Is that 10 resistors, right? Yeah, 10 resistors. So n is equal to 10, right? Number of resistors, n is equal to 10. And the resistance value, r, is equal to the set 1,000 ohms for each of them. So 1,000 ohms. So how do we get the total resistance for this question? It's simply equal to 1 all over r total, right? It's equal to n times r. Um, n is 10 times 1 over R, that's N times 1 over R, and that's equal to N is 10 times R is um, 1,000, so 1 all over 1,000, okay? 
from this this cancels this so i have one all over r this gives you one all over r total it's equal to one all over this gives you 100 i have this right to get my final answer this one goes up and this comes down so r total goes up it becomes r total all over one comes down so all over one it's equal to 100 goes up it becomes 100 all over one comes down i have one okay now in solving this i now have that of course r total all over one anything divided by one is that thing so in this case i have r total so you have r total your value has been equal to 100 divided by 1 gives you 100 and this is in ohms so i have this as 100 ohms as my answer all right so if you do that your answer would be 100 ohms so basically this is how you solve this question all right all right let me tweak this a bit i'll change this from 10 so let's say we have 8 i'm giving you 8 here um 8 resistors each with a resistance of i'm changing this from 1000 to 200.25 ohms all right so here's your task eight resistors here's your question eight resistors each with a resistance of 200.25 ohms are connected in parallel what is the total resistance so this question is for you solve this question leave your answer in the comment section and I will tell you if you are correct or not. Okay? All right, guys. So don't forget that you can check out my available courses on my website. Simply visit www.jonahimanu.com forward slash courses. Or you can look at the available books at www.jonahimanu.com forward slash books. All right? Do well to register an account to the website and then proceed to get any of the available courses or books. You can also join my channel membership to get access to exclusive classes for just channel members. All right. I'll leave a link to my website as well as to join my channel membership in the video description. Also, I'll leave a link to a WhatsApp channel. All right. So join and then you get updated on a WhatsApp channel. All right. Okay, guys. So as usual, if you enjoyed this video, please do well to hit the like button. All right. Smash the like button. Like this video. Leave a comment. For your comment, I already give you a task. All right. Solve the question. Leave your answer in the comment section, and I'll tell you if you're correct or not. Don't forget to also subscribe. If it's your first time here or you're yet to subscribe, please do want to subscribe. Hit the bell icon and select all so that you get notified whenever we upload a new content. Then share this video to your friends so that they can also learn. Thank you and see you in our next class.